Welcome to Heller for an Hour. This is Haven. Also, welcome to 2021, everyone. <laughs> so this game... This game, from what I could tell, is a mix of a love story, an RPG, and a stranded on Alien World game. It was exceptionally intriguing from the trailers and little bits I saw of gameplay, so I wanted to check it out and see how it was. But first, of course, if you guys like my content, do consider giving this video a like. And if you haven't subscribed yet, it's a fresh new year. It's time for you to subscribe. Do it. It helps. It helps a lot. Um, also, if you like to see my content early, check out my Twitch. Usually stuff gets streamed over there before it ends up on YouTube. And I have a Discord community that you can always check out if you like an active, friendly group of people, because that's what we got over there. But in any case, there is co-op. I did not realize there would be a co-op option to this. That's... I guess it kind of makes sense, but at the same time, wasn't expecting that. Also, Miranda, thank you for the being coming up subscriber. Join the pup party. So, let's, uh, let's just take a quick look at the settings. AKA, let's look to make sure there's no motion blur stuff on. <laughs> Screen shakes, that's fine. <laughs> but uh, let's let's get into it. Hey, if it is not a challenging game, we recommend starting with the default difficulty level. Uh, okay. However, you feel you'd like to enjoy Haven more by making it easier, there are different options in the pause menu available at all times. Okay. Uh, deep, de default reduce. Default's fine. Huh, I was like expecting a hard mode, but no, it's only just, it's normal or easy. Okay. Oh, fair enough, fair enough. Also, let me know what the volume is, guys. Should be fine, but... Cooking. It's a good way to start any game. What's that you got cooking? Apple do stew with apple do's. Mm, didn't we have that yesterday? Or the day before? No. Yesterday it was baked apple do with apple do's. And the day before it was fried apple do's. With apple do's. I remember now. Sorry, I'm doing what I can to switch up our meals. But in my defense, we have a pretty limited set of ingredients. Hmm. Hey, I wasn't complaining. Food is hey, food. I wasn't complaining. I'm glad that you're doing the cooking. Otherwise, I'd be eating, I guess, <laughs> apple juice. <laughs> oh, did you have a chance to look at the engine? Yeah. It does seem like it took some damage upon landing, but I should be able to fix that real quick. I also have some good news, apparently. I also have some good news. What's that? I love you. That is good news. Okay, voice acting is good so far. This is quite good. Also, yes, they do love each other. Oh, with the lights off? Works for me. <laughs> uh, no, I didn't do that. Uh, we must have run out of flow. Weren't you supposed to charge up the nest today? Excuse me if I was working on the engine. I can't do everything. No worries. I'll go get some more outside. If I'm lucky, I'll stumble upon something to spice up the apple juice. <gasps> I'll come with you. <laughs> Oh, they're a bit spicy. They were getting a bit spicy. There's nothing wrong with getting a bit spicy, man. Press down to switch characters. Okay. I don't know why I have to do it three times, but all right. Let's really demonstrate. Walk. Okay. That is walking, indeed. Walking is kind of slow. But uh, this is much faster. I can slide off and die. I better not do that, actually. We'll left stick down to a U-turn, okay. Alright. Fair enough. Over there, a flow thread. Where? Okay, sure. <laughs> I don't know where you're talking about, but can I like fly off the ledge? Is that a, is that allowed? Apparently not. 
rakit. Where am I going? Oh, down here. Okay. <laughs> Camera doesn't have a lot of, like, movement to it, so... At least not yet. Uh, that is a full thread. Ah, okay. So it's part of my glide, I guess. Whoops. Try again. I see. Perfect. Although it seems like one thread won't be enough. So we gotta glide into the threads and pick them up. How many more do you think we need? I don't know. Three? Maybe. Good thing there are plenty of flow threads around here. I have to say, turning? Hard to do in the glide. <laughs> kinda, kinda, gotta line up. Like <laughs> Hold LT while gliding drift. Oh, that helps. <laughs> that helps me turn. I wish they had told me about that earlier, honestly. <laughs> So I will comment on the, the style of music is not really my style, but I guess it works pretty well with the game so far, though. Why is that flashing? Oh. Apple juice again. Oh, we can collect. Who knows how long we're gonna be stuck here? We might as well stock up. <laughs> Alright, there's other things to get. Let's see. Before I get more flow, let's go ahead and collect more apple dues. We need all the apple dues. Also, <laughs> it's a pretty apple dude. Apple dude is probably just like he passed away small and reddish you can pick up too. Ah. Besides the apple dew? <laughs> the relationship reminds me a lot of mine and Cheryl's with little I've seen. Oh, cool. <laughs> I, I... Between me and Aragon, I'd probably be the one in the more lovey-dovey mode, but he's, 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 he's... Oh, this, there's this, what is this? Rattle pepper. Have you ever seen such a thing? Hmm. No, never. Must be an endemic species. And I know it wasn't here yesterday. I mean, 24 hours ago. Y you know what I'm saying. I wonder if it's edible. Go ahead, taste it. Go ahead, taste it. Why should I be the one to test it? Oh, sorry, one second. There we Your go. Your body mass is higher, so you have better resistance to poison. Oh. And also, you saw them first. I wouldn't dream of stealing the discovery from you. Think about it. You'll be the first person in the universe to ingest these berries. If you won't do it for us, please do it for science, Kay. Okay. Cut. For science. <coughs> Is it that bad? No. Ooh, no. It's just very peppery. Let me taste. <laughs> oh, yeah. These are good, actually. You really have an infant's palate. <laughs> Off we go. Let's pick these. I'm not sure these will go great with the apple dews, but where there's a meal, there's a way. You can, you know pe you can pepper for it. With apple dews, apple dews. All right, and before, since uh, gliding just lets you pick up flow threads, I'm gonna ignore gliding for a bit and just try to grab, I guess, items. Since there's items around. Oop. It isn't ripe yet. That might give it a different flavor if it's not ripe. Sometimes picking an unripe thing is actually gonna give you some new flavors. So this game has a huge focus on a very healthy relationship. For all for it. Yeah. It's a shame that Aragon can't be a little more lovey-dovey sometimes, but it's just not his character, you know. He does love me very, very much, though. It's just that I have to be the one in the shade the hugs, you know? <laughs> well, you have a water source, that's good. Sorry, birds. We didn't see you. There are birds? <laughs> I didn't see them. <laughs> I 
Oh, they'll take me as complaining too much. I'm just a dog, so I'm the sort of I'm the sort that like it. I'm all charged up. Oh. Me too. We can go when you're ready. I'm the sort of guy. I'm the sort of dog. Well, I'm a dog. I I will always heavily value physical interaction. Too slow. Too slow. Plenty of threads out there. Technically, I think I have enough, but. My, my 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 blue ball thing is full, so it, I guess it's fine. All right, this is a pretty small landmass, though, all said. So let's go up back to the ship. I think I picked the pepper. That seems to be the only thing out here, aside from more apple juice. So. Oh, Piper, I didn't even know you left. That's fine, dude. Enter nest. <laughs> They're love nest. <laughs> I get it. It's fit all right. You don't really need to leave for some. Well, that's true. All good. This should last us a few days. Now it's our turn to fill up. Huh? I'm hungry. Oh. oh. Well, I, I'm a third person observer that's just hanging out with them now. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna look around. So, we can exit, which. Well, no reason to right now, but. <laughs> Those are some tattered clothes. Actually, no, they're just. Never mind, they're not tattered. I just looked at it wrong. <laughs> I'm gonna look around. But, uh. I had a. I had a oh, yeah, I was gonna say. I appreciate any game with a lot of dialogue where it's actually voice acted. Because I gotta say, the most, uh, I guess, strenuous Howler for, Howler for an Hours is probably the ones where it's like a visual novel, but I gotta, but there's no, there's no voice acting. I don't technically have to voice the characters in that situation, but I always do. So. Hmm. Okay. Yes? I just thought of something. If I am on the couch, and you are on the couch, who is cooking dinner right now? The, the magical third party observer that, that I am. If I could cook, I could cook dinner. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> I like how our mind's old, it's like completely on food. Like, we could talk, but then there's not food. Just inspect. Wow. These floating islands are really something. Yeah. Never imagined I would ever see this. So we're on a floating plant. We're on a floating island world. It's a common. That's a common type of world in science fiction, but it's also a pretty fun one. Cure. Do you need anything? No. Huh. Me neither. Oh, we can see our health bars here. I guess. First. Don't expect me to fall asleep on an empty stomach. That's the worst way to fall asleep, so I understand entirely. Also, floating table. I just noticed that. <laughs> and chairs, for that matter. That'd be very easy. Actually, everything's kind of float. If it could float, make it float, unless it's a pilot seat. Though it actually makes sense to make the pilot seat not float, because if you ever have a power issue or whatever, you definitely want to make the pilot seat still functioning correctly. What's this? Oh, plants. They're, they have a little pro area. That's kind of cool, actually. And very important if they're, you're stranded on a planet to have a little grow area. That's, that's good. That's a very good thing. Eat. But do I cook? I cook there. Okay. Okay. Yes. Can we cook something? What? Do we already eat everything? Yeah. <laughs> like how this game is the least so far doesn't like exposition the hell out of you. Yeah, it's just. It's kind of, kind of normal conversation, and it's obvious like something happened. I, I think I remember from some plot details from like trailer stuff or just descriptions that they are stranded. Uh, but you wouldn't immediately get that impression. Well, you kind of do. You kind of get that impression because like obviously their engine is broken and they're scavenging for food. So clearly there's a bit of a situation here, but they're not super you know stressed out about it right now. Where's the peppers I got? Also, how many? Uh, RB switch. Ah, there we go. Let's 
let's see here. Oh, okay. Oh, I need three of those, and then... Okay, sure. Spicy apple do. Who knows what effects it will have on us. Is that like, like some sort of DNA strand? This could this could genetically mutate us, but let's have it for dinner. <laughs> I mean, it's it's good. It's good flavor, so it's worth it. <sighs> eat now, cook more. Uh, well, we well, can only make one, so let's eat now. Arby switched to something right there. Yeah. People always make a big deal about salty sweet, but never peppery sweet, which it turns out is delicious. Yeah, I was gonna say pepper and sweet can work. Delicious to you. Seeing your diet in the last few days? True. But don't let that take away from your cooking talents. You're just wanting to finish my plate, aren't you? <laughs> Since you're offering. So, like, pepper and sweetness can work quite well because pepper is very harsh and sweet's very mellow. So they kind of balance each other out. If, if done right. Eating sounds. Well, we all like eating How sounds. How long do you think this is going to last? The flow? What if we keep our consumption in check? I think a few days. No, I meant us. Us here. How long until they come get us? Ah, uh, do we have to talk about this? We're gonna need to at some point. Oh, okay. We are going to need to at some point. We need to be prepared. We need a plan. I'm planning on finishing my plate without hearing about the apiary. Is that okay? Okay. Okay. And FYI, you are the one that ruined the mood, not me. Sorry? <laughs> oh, I can, I can cook more if I want to. Well, I don't have any peppers, so there's no point. How do I leave the screen? <laughs> oh, dialogue log. A dialogue, you could say. <laughs> Fighting gloves, keep away from children. And to grab boots, two feet high and rising. Ribbon. They each have keepsakes. Down A. Down an A? Oh, I have to double cancel. Down an A. Did not work. I'm holding them down. <laughs> oh, no, I have to let go. Okay, that's a slightly unintuitive way to cancel, but all right, whatever. We've already eaten too much. I can never eat too much. Okay? I've already eaten too much. <laughs> can I never eat too much? She is, she's t very much tempted me to order wow. some delivery today. <laughs> These floating islands are really something. Yeah. Never imagined I would ever see this. Wanna have a chat for bed? Talk about how you guys were mad at each other or something? <laughs> Do you think it's time to go to bed? If you say so. This girl's charm. Yes. Or more specifically, I do have a female variant my, of myself. Charm. Just switch the E and the M around. Um... So, this, this girl is charm, you could say. It's actually funny we're talking about that, because I actually have another female uh, variant self, my mind form. Uh, she's going to gain some artwork, actually, pretty soon. Uh, pr after the stream, I'm actually going to go talk to the artist I was talking to and present an idea together. Um, so, yeah. Uh, it's going to be a bit of a spicy comic, but I might be able to share a panel or two. Do you need anything? No. So, you guys no. in general. Me neither. You? All right. Let's talk about it. Fine. <laughs> uh, I was just gonna ask if you could switch off the light. <laughs> You've been mulling it over this whole time? Of course I've been mulling it over this whole time. Thank you for adding one more thing to my mind. Hold on. Are you telling me you hadn't thought about it before? You know what? No, I hadn't thought about it. I'm trying not to think about the apiary. Enjoy what we have here. Even if it isn't much. Uh, Do you really think that they can come get us here? Hmm. If we could take the flow bridge here, then so can they. But there's no way they can know where we are. Is there? I cut off the auto nav, the astrolock. Even the landing was all manual. 
I'm just saying, let's prepare for the worst. So at first I thought they were talking about a rescue party, but it kind of, yeah, this is, listen, you don't normally have to talk about killing a rescue party. There's, this is not a rescue party they were talking about. Um, oh no, God, no, not the second one, the first one. At worst, I kill them. Whoa, you. What? If that's what it takes not to go back, I'll do it. No problem. Hmm. Kill them? Steal their ship? By the time they send more guys, we'll be far away. You're seriously not considering... Maybe not. Maybe I am. At worst, we'll know. You're scaring me. <laughs> oh, come on. You're totally safe. Does sound like they ran away from something. Bear. I'm not sure how I should take this. Okay. <laughs> Well, take me in your arms for a start. An arresting party or possibly a come back to the fold party of some sort. Forcibly bring you back to an organization party. Which is why he reacted with like, oh, kill him. Like, because this doesn't sound like they're, they're seeking us out to kill us. Probably, but. I do like how this is a better way. So we played a lot of games that just dumped way too much like dialogue about the story on us. I usually complain about that, you know? I usually complain about the games that just you dump story. Yet? I put on my pajamas. It's good I enough. Mean, to get out. Well, see. Okay, this planet only has you two. You may as well wear your pajamas we outside. Out? Can't we just hang in the nest for once? Lounge around, read a book, watch a movie. We don't have movies. Right. Sure. No? But you have a size nice ship and no movies. But yeah, I, I, I really appreciate because a lot of howlers have actually. I, I generally have been like kind of. Not interested in the story a lot of times because a lot of games feel like, oh, we need to explain our world and we have all these like magical terms uh, that, for just our story. And uh, we, we, let me tell you everything about it. And let me tell you everything about the world and everything about the history of the world. And it's like game. I'd like to play you, not just like do a history lesson. Like you can tell me this stuff, but you got to do it in a more effective way. And you know what a more effective way is? What this game is doing. There's clearly stuff going on. There's clearly a lot of history going on here. Uh, with what happened in the setting and stuff, but we're getting it in natural nuggets as people, as a couple people are just casually chatting and talking. And this is a much better way to present story because this lets you, first off, it's kind of spaces it out. Doesn't make this, it, it, this huge slog of a priority right at the beginning, but also it lets you get to know the characters along the way, which is good because a lot of games, when they're doing that, like here's the history of our world, but guess what? You're not getting characterization in that situation. But in this situation, you get both characterization and a nice nice flow that's not too heavy of the story, the setting, the plot, etc. Anyways. Come on, the weather's great. But the weather is always great. For now, <laughs> who knows? Tomorrow could be the beginning of the long winter months. It could last for years. One more reason to stock up on apple juice. Mm. <laughs> you know, always being right is not necessarily a good quality. On the contrary, many people find it very unappealing. Yeah. You? Not sure. I'd rather know less and care more than care less and know more. Also, this does the show don't tell aspect because I can look around the ship. I can be like, oh, so this is what their ship details and like, here's what the world looks like here. And they got a nice, here's a galaxy. Actually, here's a galaxy chart. Looks like this is the uh, particular galaxy they're in. Like I can look around and find details to tell me a little bit more about the characters and possibly the setting. And this is a much better way to learn about a world than being told, here's how the history of the world. Actually, let's look at these. Bunch of photos of them somewhere. Is, is there only were these all taken here? It's hard to tell. I, I think when it comes to explaining your world, the best way to do it is visually. It's okay to explain it in text, but I usually think that either it should be optional text logs that you can find and read on your own leisure, or it should be um, present. It should flow naturally as the plot progresses and not be too heavy. Learn as you go is much is a much better strategy for a game, you know. Books can maybe get away from with the uh, expositoriness, you know. A book or a movie can maybe get away with it, but in a game, a game should be a game, and then it should be a story, you know. Games can have great stories, but they should also be great games. I probably could have rested on the couch and talked. I just realized. Whoops. Oh well, whatever. 
Do you remember where the apple dews were? Can we try and pick something else for a change? Yeah, they have been for here for a while if those photos were taken here. Actually, can I just go back and Don't you think we should try and no. find something better than apple I might have skipped sorry if I skipped a conversation, but it's all the more reason to play it yourself if I I probably will miss conversations. You probably can find ones I don't check. And of course this is only an hour playthrough. Unless I, of course, decide to play longer. We'll see how the game, what the game does for me. On that note. This is where you're supposed to get the pepper. Well, I got the pepper. Is it me or is oh. the ground shaking? It's shaking. It's shaking a lot. How could a Floyd Island have an earthquake? <laughs> Oh, well, I guess it can have sonic shockwaves. Oh, our ship. Oh, no. That's probably not good for it. No, that wasn't good for it at all. To be fair, though, at least it didn't go the other direction, a.k.a. off the island. <laughs> Is it over? Seems like it. A anything broken? No, no, I don't think so. <sighs> well, except. <sighs> it's not all lost. It's not it all. Could have gone the other direction. Well, it is a bit. Look, we can always search the islet, try and find a way to get to the other side. Such as. I, I don't know. A, a rope, a jetpack, spring-loaded shoes, anything. I forgot there were repulsion boots. Uh. And if we don't find it? If we don't find... Uh, I don't know. That's why we'll have to find something. Okay. Oh, I see. We're actually... Oh, right. Now, <laughs> ship's uh, separated from us, too. Get it. Oh, oh my! Oh, oh! And now it's in a slightly more precarious position. Excellent. If another earthquake happens, that ship's gone. <laughs> you know what? It's fine. We have apple juice. Um. That is slightly problematic. <laughs> I think I found something. Huh? <gasps> Call me crazy, but this looks like a bluten. Yep, it looks like a flow bridge. Kind of like the one we took to get here, but smaller? Is that possible? Why not? We, we still don't really know how the flow bridges work in space, but if the phenomenon can happen on a macro scale, then why not on this one? If there can be flow between two planets, why not two bits of a planet? I mean, technically, float islands are their own if planets this really in a way. Is a flow bridge, I'm not sure what we're waiting for. What? Flow bridges are linking one place to another, right? So this one definitely leads someplace. Wait, y you want to just get on there without knowing where it goes? Surely, it up. goes elsewhere. I think uh, that's as good as. I mean, it might go to space in the asphyxiate, uh, but you know, maybe not. The first the more important question, did I miss any apple juice? I don't think I did. Yeah, it seems like that's the only thing. Just some apple juice for the road. All right, let's go. Ooh. It could go to a volcano. Then you get spicier peppers at the volcano. Do we have everyone? Okay? Here. <laughs> then we're good. Looks like we're on another islet. Yeah. The bridge seems to be a link between the islets. If there are any others like this, we may be able to get back to the nest. We could just explore and set up a new civilization. Hello. Do you see what I'm seeing? Uh, a big ugly lizard? You mean cute? No, the mushrooms on its back. Looks like a type of hygrocybrubicins. Ah, is that good news? Like, <laughs> can we eat it? <laughs> That's the important question. Not at all. Can you eat the lizard? Unless you're looking for a quick way to unload your kidneys. But don't you find that symbiosis amazing? 
the movements of the lizard are helping spread the spores. As far as what the lizard is gaining, I'll have to study that closer. Maybe it doesn't even know. Maybe it doesn't even know. Maybe we should tell it. No way. You don't get in the way of Mother Nature's plans. I'll make sure I remember that next time you have salad stuck in your teeth. Hello. Scratch? Friendly lizard! <laughs> this is so slow. We're not going anywhere. So? That's pretty cute. Morale pepper. Three of those, I can make another spicy bill. What's this thing? Oh, I'm swimming now. That's fine. Okay, what? No, seriously, what is this? It's It has wires. Or is this a plant? It doesn't really look like a plant. And at the same time, it looks like a plant. I don't know. Make sure they don't get squished. Where are we storing them, actually? Supposed to be helpful to get more flow. Actually, I think I might have enough. I'm not really sure. I found another one. You, you scritch him too. Equal opportunity scritching. This is this one just keeps going. Oh. It doesn't work if you warn me after you turn. Also, the camera kind of confused me there for a minute. I forget about drifting. Yeah. I don't need. I don't need to do it every time. Isn't that the full bridge? No, that's a new one. I don't think that's the one I was just using, was I? Oh. How did you get down there without me? <laughs> Alright, well. This cuties need a rocks too. You mean the mushroom lizards? Wouldn't be against. Remember, this is not the first time we saw a mushroom lizard in a sci-fi game. Absolutely. Well, you know what? Make a, guys, I usually make rocks off the cliffs. So if you like something enough, we'll need to wait a little bit for it to grow. Then you should clip it. Here, I'll even give you an opportunity. Yeah, that's a general rule of thumb. If you guys like something enough and you would like to see it as a rocks, do make sure to clip, give it a clip. That may indeed get, create. It's very cute, though. That may indeed create a rocks later. So, of course, I don't know if you guys are making rocks or not. Sometimes it's hard for me to tell. So, you guys may have already made a rocks, but I figured I'd bring it up. Feel free to coordinate. Like, hey, are you gonna make a rocks? You're not. I'm gonna make a rocks then, or rather, or I'm gonna make a clip then. Is what I mean. I think I found all the peppers here. Because I actually, I, I very much agree with you. I prefer making rocks on animal stuff, if Come I can. Grow, little bud. And, uh... Can do it. <laughs> I like that there's even messages if I interact with stuff I've already picked up. Well, that one's sleeping. Hi. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Seems like our mini flow bridge. Good. 
Not a unique occurrence. Oh, look, they're getting dressed up for a night on the town. <sighs> that, that we can't really do that here, but wow. you know. That's actually. What is that? It's we red. Take a closer look. It's red. That red is bad. Maybe. Actually, I'm not sure. Yeah, if I don't, here's another, re if you're wondering why I stop, let me tell you, if I stop, I can move the camera up and down a lot. If I'm at all move, if I'm doing this at all, even if I am drifting, I can't move the camera much. But if I completely stop, I can look around. Like a lot easier, camera move is a lot, is, is kind of unlocked if you stop. So there is a value to stopping, if I actually want to look around. What's underneath our feet, Mr. Geologist? I don't know if we should have just like walked right into it, but okay. I'm a biologist. And biologists learn things by thing? stepping to them. Biology, the living, geology, the rocks. And what makes you think this is not living, pray tell? Uh, well, it kind of looks living. It looks like a dust deposition. Some kind of rust. And it looks like this kind of rust is particularly sensitive to flow. What? Look beneath your feet. Oh, there's vegetation underneath. It was probably smothered. Good thing we came this way. Oh, we can oh, clear it up. Look. Great. We can bring that back to the nest to study it. Oh. Good. Now it's like, now it's like Mario Sunshine. I'm okay with this. Time to clean this area up. This is probably not a good thing, whatever it is. I'm not 100 percent sure, but we almost missed this one. I almost did. <laughs> walking clears it up. Yeah, but walking slow. <laughs> also, oh, I'm revealing Here? stuff That's underneath. I think. To go. I think the way this may actually reveal items sometimes. Oh, oh, if I get, oh, I don't have to get, clear up every little bit. I just need to go for the deposits. That makes Let's sense. Let's give them time to ripen a bit. So you clear out a deposit and it all goes away. Now I'm hungry. I know, right? Straight your flow. Oh, is it? Oh yeah, I guess it is reacting, isn't it? I'm stuck. All right, there we go. Well, I can get more flow. Whoa, okay. Even the apple dew shrubs are completely covered. I'm sure they're still fine. I hope this one will yield some nice and juicy fruit to thank us. Uh, you're walking right in the middle of that? Is that a good idea? I guess it's not hurting us. Rest. Saw that. Hmm. It doesn't care. Yeah, I guess not. It's easy to tell if I cleared up an area or not, though. Just gotta see if it uh, if there's any sludge remaining, then I haven't cleared it up. <laughs> Watch that the lizards actually live off that, and I'm basically committing them to starve now that I've removed it. Ooh, secret, secret pepper. That's kind of out of the way. I mean, rust isn't normally edible, but who knows? It's an alien planet. Yum. Matter of fact, yum. Another flow bridge. That's great. 
Oh. It means there must be others. If we're lucky, they'll bring us back to the nest. Why? Right, some more. See some more food I missed. <laughs> this is the most. This is my priority. You only get one rattle pepper at a time, so it's good to get as much of it as possible. It's kind of a scarce resource, I guess you could say. I actually wonder what the food system does mechanically. Like, if I don't get food, do we start to take damage, or...? Hello. This feels relaxing, and I'm starting to dig the music now. I think I got everything. From what I could tell. Well, this is like run through and whatnot. Now this is this is a this is an RPG though. Find the nest if we keep going north. Explain to me how you know which way north is on this planet. Uh, we should find the nest if we keep going straight ahead. <laughs> Thank you. Aha. Another one. We're too heavy. Nah, this aerial threat is just too fragile. Uh, hi. What's your deal? Oh, it's okay. Relax, thing. Come on, don't be scared. A big bug like you. Hey, we're friends with the bugs. <laughs> I thought it was an enemy or something at first, but no. Just a sort of like mildly creepy, mildly interesting bug. Fair enough. Well, Beerus, you know the rule I just said about clips and rocks, so... <laughs> I do encourage people to clip if they think they found something interesting in my, in my, in my uh, streams. I do look them over, after all. So... Kill it, ew, ew, ew. Also, also, it was kind of a quirky bug. I don't think it looked that bad. It was covered in moss, too. It's kind of interesting. Don't be mean. Oh, it's, is it getting dark? Is time passing? Hello. I think I was asking. Ugh, my stomach. It needs to be fed soon. That was asking for a spritch. It went squeak, so I had to do something. I'm not sure what rust is useful for, but we'll, we'll, we'll experiment with that. I did not realize time was passing. That's actually really cool. Oh, what? What is this? I thought this planet was supposed to be a desert. Deserted, not a desert. It's clearly not a desert. According to the archives. A colonization plan had been considered by the Apiary, with Exanova as the main provider. But the planet was eventually classified as inhospitable. Let me guess. High seismic activity, probably. High seismic activity? I don't know. The file doesn't say anything about that. Hmm. I hope we don't have any more unpleasant surprises. Yeah, it's true, Beerus did have his own rocks. I was like, explains the wires I saw earlier. So I just it was weird. So I'm gonna go down here, jeez. It's a plant hey. I can- Hey! What? Everything slow motion. Easy. Easy. Sorry, I, I interrupted that bit because I had to pet a bug. Alright. 
I don't know what she was going on about, but... <laughs> oh, wow. I think Jet Boots let you kind of float. <laughs> oh. We're gonna get stuffed. That's the idea. All clean. Islet cleans. I think you gotta clean an island to go to the next one, perhaps. Which does indicate it's not a good thing, whatever the rust is. I mean, generally, if it's called rust, it's probably not a great thing. Hello. This one is nice and ripe. Linky to rocks, that should work. I wonder if there's other foods. Are we saving those for later? Of course. Oh, I think I see. Of course, she said, horfing it down. She's just eating straight peppers. <laughs> I mean, fi fair enough, I guess. Of course, we're saving. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Can I get away the land. Yeah, I gotta get up there. <laughs> You have been told to cool a caps lock before. Would you mind cooling up a caps lock before we have to do other things besides just asking? Because I really would hate it if it had to escalate to us to be like, all right, you're you're gonna temporarily not be able to talk for a while or something. I really don't like di dispensing punishments. Moment, aren't we the lucky ones? Oh, new. new oh, this uh, is new. What are they? You've never heard of boba nuts? They're one of the most nutritious nuts. Oh. 25% carbohydrates, 50% protein, 75% lipids. That's 150%. <laughs> that adds up to 150%. That's why they're so great! Precisely. A great mystery of modern science. <laughs> really? You're pulling my leg, aren't you? Maybe. But once you have a taste of my boba salad, you will forget all about it. I don't know, man. I'd like some boba fettuccine. Because <laughs> then it's a pun. <laughs> Okay, now I'm really starving. Imagine how I feel. Hmm. Haven't been down there. Can't quite remember. Let's, see, let's find out. <laughs> we. Oh, I have, unfortunately. <laughs> Also, I can't walk down things like that, but I sure can fly down. Apple boba, pepper boba, apple apple. Well, I need I need more more bobas probably. We could presume a maximum of five boba nuts to do. Well, I, I mean, if they had a hundred percent, fifty percent nutrition, maybe not that many, but that seems to be the only boba around. I probably got apple juice for weeks. Um, let's go. I just like gathering. I don't know. It's fun, in a weird way. We're here. We found the nest. But in what state? Slight, uh, slightly less wings. <laughs> I did notice wings falling off. Like the the yeah. Do you think that's impressive? We can fly too. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. There is no way this thing is flying again. Don't say that. You could make a rock fly with the right tools. Well, maybe. But not this one. Both wings are wasted. The propellers were ripped off. And I'm not even done checking the inside. We weren't really planning on leaving, were we? We don't really have another place to go anyway. I'm tired. Why are we always so unlucky? <clears throat> <laughs> I'm not sure this is the Why right title. Hold on. We decide to escape the Apiary. 
which apparently no one has managed to do before us. We punch in some coordinates really at random, only because some obscure document from Exanova vaguely attested to the existence of a habitable planet. By some kind of miracle, we cross the boundaries of the apiary without getting caught. We travel across space in a Class D ship that is totally not designed for that. And in spite of the fact that this is not all terrain, we land without breaking anything. We find food and flow on site, even though we hadn't really planned for it. Finally, we get hit with an earthquake, all right, but we get out of it unscathed. The only real consequence is that the nest is a little bit busted. <laughs> and you think that we're unlucky? You, we are the luckiest people in the universe. That's, that's one way to see it. This planet is our chance to start a new life with our own rules, away from the apiary, from the matchmaker and all that loot. And I'd rather endure a thousand earthquakes than risk being away from you. What did you say this planet was called again? Source. Source. The beginning of something. Seems like it. He could, I, you know, what would have been a nice addition? And the luckiest thing of all, we get to be together. <laughs> That would have been a perfect way to cap off the luck, the luck statement. Also, it's nighttime now. This one's a little rotten, isn't it? You're a little rotten. Huh? Sorry, it was a reflex. <laughs> it's only people's a reflex, apparently. Mmm, not bad. Hey. That's for cooking. Oh, you are one to talk. <laughs> you're saying you're not eating that now, right? No, no, no. So I guess we can flow around now with the uh, connection points, which seem to I'm gonna guess they come and go, given that they weren't there before, and then now they're here. Now they might go away, and maybe maybe new ones open up. Let's go the next day, actually. I think I found all there is to f wait. That most certainly was not three before. Oh wait, that's the other island, right? <laughs> so we can't. Well, it was originally our island, but now it's not. So, it, you know what I mean. How, how much food do I even have at this point? Whoa! What a mess! Doesn't, doesn't and now the cut. nest is all akimbo. This feels weird. Yeah. We'll need to find a way to correct that. But it can wait until tomorrow. I think we've had our share for the day. A slight slant never hurt anyone. To relax. If you know what I mean. You can do whatever you want. But I am going to bed. Oh, some of the stuff stayed on the shelf. How did that? Wait. We saw it, like, turn to tumble over itself. How the fuck are these on the shelf still? Maybe we cleaned up a bit before I got to cutscene mode. <laughs> if you know what I mean, yeah. Come on. Let's go to bed instead. I've had enough of this day. That thing seems wow. relatively functional. These floating islands are really something. Whoa, 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 look at the sky! Never imagined I would ever see this. Okay, now I wish stars were like Christmas lights now. <laughs> Red and blue? Stars in addition to white? That would be so cool if the night sky was like that. I'm not hungry. Wow. I never thought I would hear you say that in my whole life. I guess my stomach has a deep connection to the nest condition. Do you want to tidy up a bit? No. Tomorrow. I don't feel strong enough right now. Is it an egg timer? <laughs> I'm not hungry. I never thought I would hear you say that in my whole life. I guess my stomach has a deep connection to the nest condition. Do you want to tidy up a bit? Do you need anything? No. Huh. Me neither. Well, thank you, Critori. Hmm? You okay? Uh, 
You wake up. <sighs> it's okay. I'm here. <sighs> that was just a nightmare. Everything's fine. That... that wasn't a nightmare. Sure it was. <laughs> Rest easy. No! I was awake. I, I could hear you. I just couldn't move or yell. Oh. I couldn't breathe. Is that a night terror? It was horrible. Yeah, I'm familiar with that. For real? It used to happen when I was a teenager. You feel something weighing on your stomach? Yeah. On my chest. What was it? I don't know. I used to call it the ball. Because sometimes mm -hmm. it felt like a huge ball. Sleep paralysis is a real thing. Oh. No, that didn't happen to me. I wouldn't wish it upon you. For me, it resolved itself when I left the foster home. For you, it may be related to the nest. But I don't want to leave the nest. That's not what I meant. You're stuck to the bed. The nest is stuck to the ground. There must be something in that. You've been flying in this thing for years. I bet you're upset to see it in this condition. Huh. No kidding. Which means that if we fix up the nest, this will all go away? I don't think I've experienced sleep, sleep paralysis well, myself. Worst case scenario, the nest will be fixed. <laughs> yeah. But it does not well, sound good at all. I hope we'll eventually find the missing parts then. So I can get fixed up too. That's a relationship beater, isn't it? That was like a DNA strand at first, but... It's like two heartbeats together. All right. Now we can see a lot clearer. Yeah, we're not there yet, but that should do the trick for now. Now we just need to figure Yikes. out how to level the nest. Read the what you guys are saying. Is probably done charging. Let's bring it outside. Tractor you think it'll be enough to lift it? I hope so. Because I have no idea what else we can do. Tractor globe. As if I feel sleepy right now. Oh, have a shower. You? Yeah? I see you've brushed your hair in the shower again. How can you tell? It's not draining. Uh, sorry. Don't do that. That's rude. <laughs> you don't want to clear hair for drains. That's just gross. What are you looking at? Ah! The distance between us and the apiary. I wouldn't expect it to change. Hi, Kratori. I said. Exactly. I said thanks for the it's earlier comforting. message. Eat time. Eight. Okay. Yes. Can we cook some? What? Do we? Yeah. Oh, right. Actually, let's chat it first. It did feel a bit weird at first, but now I can't even tell the nest is tilted. I guess I got used to it. What? No, 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 no. You cannot get used to it. We're going to get the nest out of this crevasse. You kind of want to move it anyways. It's on the edge of the it. cliff now, like even more than before. You don't want to. You don't. You want to move it, regardless of slant. But let's cook first. Okay, so I don't have enough of those to boba nets to do anything. So. Do this again, though. This is a nice game, isn't it? Hey, you never told me. What did your mate look like? Eh, I don't know. Didn't you get her file from the matchmaker? Yeah, I did. But I never really looked at it. Oh. Seriously? You're not even curious? Well, no. <laughs> I already knew you. <laughs> Whatever. Come on. We'll look at it together. I, I really get the impression. Huh. Oh, all right. Any other pictures? Forced marriage, it yeah. seems like. 
It's like here's what the here's what the status Just here's who the status said you, you should marry. So? Yeah, definitely. Don't you? Now I understand all the more why they wanted to run away. I don't know. Too much makeup, I think. I mentioned the matchmaker before. I guess I missed it. Natural look. Or didn't understand what it meant. Mm -hmm. Do you really think I'm not wearing any kind of makeup right now? Um. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Let's check her profile instead of this foolishness. Let's see. Interests. Reading, music, having a drink with my friends. Whoa. Do you think you can handle such a strong personality? <laughs> That's harsh. Job. Ocean biology research assistant at the University of Ox. Huh. Okay. Looks like you two are made for each other. No one is made for each other. That's the kind of rhetoric the matchmaker uses. Yeah. Yeah, I know. But it still looks to me like that was a blooting good pick. You'd make a great couple. Might have made. There's a difference. Uh, tell me. Are you really wearing makeup right now? <laughs> we spend every waking minute together in the nest. If I discreetly slipped into the bathroom every morning to put on some eyeliner, don't you think you'd notice? <laughs> yeah. What does bloop mean? <laughs> At least, I think. But you're not really answering my question, though. I know. <laughs> yes, there is combat in this game. I kind of would like to play to the combat. It would be a better review if I did. Feet. <laughs> it did feel a bit weird at first. But now I can't even tell the nest is tilted. Oh. I get what? No, no, I don't want to get... We already did that. Let's go outside of that. Fazzy swear word. Fair enough. Loot. It's like the most inoffensive sounding one. For the road. Huh. Sounds good. I'll bring the first aid kit as well. Just in case. <laughs> oh, is he, uh... I think I may have missed something, Beerus. What, why did we remove them? Oh, we're bringing first aid kits. I think we're gonna... If we're bringing first aid kits, maybe we're gonna get to the combat then. Because there is combat in this game. I, I hear. That's Razor. Oh, okay. But why did he... Come back. I don't know. I did, I did not understand why some people try to come come by when once they've hit a perma band status. Oh well, did that didn't work. No, I don't think so. Balding blute. Oh, it's oh, over. Balding blute. That's even it's more of a swear word. Straight. We'll never be able to fix it. We are condemned to living on an incline in a broken ship forever. Until our body adapts and one of our legs starts shrinking to even us out. So how things... Wait, what's the issue? What's the issue exactly? Well, the back pain will be crazy, for one. And also, I don't know about you, but I personally like having a reasonably symmetrical body. I meant with the track the globe. Ah. Not enough power, it seems like. The battery drains out even before lifting the nest a centimeter off the ground. Although, to be fair, it was originally designed to lift cargo crates into ships. Not the ships, themselves. What if we plugged it into a full spring? I thought about that, but we'd have to be able to seal the pipe shut. Unfortunately, I don't think they make gaskets for flow springs from a distant planet. Perhaps we can make one. With what? Paper mache? Remember yesterday when I told you that rust scatters when it comes in contact with flow? We could use that feature to sculpt the gasket out of pieces of rust. That one voice line was quieter. You could do that? I don't think I could sculpt a nude statue of you or a super complex component, but molding a gasket? That seems doable. That's awesome! <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, let's not start pushing before the panties are pulled down. Excuse me? <laughs> You've never heard of that saying? No. Must be a truth thing then. That means let's not celebrate before we. Yeah, yeah, I got it. <laughs> anyway, how much rust do you need in order to <laughs> pull the panties down? Uh, I don't know, <laughs> four or five blocks, like those we already got. Okay, so let's try and find that. I like how Car said, "The more we watch this, the more it feels like you is charm in the scenario." Yeah, she does seem a lot like, <laughs> including the including the fact that she is like, gets anxious. Quite anxious about the situation. I, I, that that reminds me of me too. 
And then, of course, also the... Can I, like, go... Wait, can I, like... Oh, that's kind of cool. Ah, neat. What just happened? I don't know. Broke. I messed Seems up. Seems like our anti-grab boots aren't powerful enough to lift us on top of the airflows. Hmm. Could you tune them up? Mm, not without the proper tools. But yeah, she likes food a lot. She gets anxious and kind of maybe... Sorry. You know, gets a little too we'll crazy about, time. gets gets a little too gets a little too caught up in like, well, we're never gonna be able to fix this. You know, that that does remind me of me a bit, like, and uh, yeah, she, and also just yeah, her personality type a lot. I, I agree with you. Sweet old tractor globe, doing its best. I need. Even though it'll and you? Never work without a new gasket. Food type. I would like to play a little bit longer to get to the combat, I think. It doesn't feel like a fair review th without getting into it. Assuming, of course, it doesn't take too much longer. I mean, we just got- we just- we were- we were heavily advised to bring first aid kits on this mission. This particular mission. So I have a hunch that we're going to get into a fight. Because, like, it'd be kind of pointless otherwise, I'd say. Alright, let's go up top side. Eh, I guess we could choose either way. Hi, boy. Because, yeah, the combat system, I saw just a little bit of it. It did intrigue me. I'd like to see how it works. Are you sure we want to go back there? Why not? Well, we've already looked there, and I'm not sure what more we can find. Oh, okay. We're looking for parts to fix the nest. It seems like we should search new places, don't you think? Makes sense. I saw another bridge a little further down. My guess is we're more likely to find some good stuff over there. Up there on the or hill? bad stuff. I'm just saying we'll find some stuff. So I'm getting the impression that you guys are interested in my female uh, forms. And would like to see them around. <laughs> I might seem pretty, like, well, gay. <laughs> But uh, I actually am bi, so and I I do right care now. a lot about so what you know female and male characters are both really awesome, so. <laughs> this way is also full of rust. Not for long. Well, 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 Beerus. That was the fault of everyone in, on staff here. Actually, now that Car's a moderator, he could technically do that too. Somebody, does one of my mods want to show how Car how that works? Here, another big chunk. We probably should grab some more, just to be sure. Oh yeah, key? It's been here and there. It's on FA. You can find FA stuff. Used to have a female form for my old Charmillion self. And of course I got mined as my, uh, kind of major, uh, you know, uh, Shadoxes have three states, three fo three forms of an E, like Pokemon have forms, like, kind of like how, kinda you know, struggling. like, kind of like Zen form, etc. But, uh... Let me know when you have enough for us to make the gas get mind, body, and soul. For sure. Or rather, body, mind, soul, if you want the proper order. For Shadoxes, those are the three form trifectas. My mind form is exclusively female. Um, though my body self, the one you guys recognize the most, the one you see all over the place. My body self, my body form can also be female if I decide to. Ghost dog, after all. I can, uh, I can kind of fluctuate this stuff. Just a little more rust, and we'll be set. When I take on a female form, it's usually because I'm feeling a little bit more, um... A little bit more... I don't know, warm? Emotional? In a good way? Emotional in a good way. I want to, I want to be a little bit smoother, I want to be a little more tender, I guess. That's usually how I, that's usually when I take on a female form. My mind form. Oh, 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 whoa! Be careful. These creatures don't okay. seem to be in their right. Okay. I wasn't paying too much attention. I, I did notice that. Here's a fight. <laughs> also, oh no, the lizards are not wanting scratches. Wait, hold left. Hold the charge in order. Okay. Oh, I see. Impact. Wait, pacify. Well, obviously pacify. They're not evil. First we weaken it, then we pacify. It. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. So we're striking them. All right. That's it. Huh. Oh, I see. I control both of them with. I see. I see. I use the D-pad for 
uh, the guy, and I used the what? What was wrong? What, what happened there? There we go. Ah, ah, I see. Can I? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. I see how this works. This is an interesting system, actually. We should be able to pacify it. Copy that. So it's okay to beat him up all the way. That's how we rock. And now he's back to being sweet. Good. <laughs> Seems like it was the rust that made him aggressive. Any idea why? It could just be because they're uncomfortable. Yeah, where is the HP bar? If the rust hurts them, that would explain why they're turning violent. But it doesn't explain why they're attacking us and not fighting amongst themselves. Maybe the rust is taking over their nervous system in some way, like a parasite. Or maybe it's because of pheromones. You can also say, I don't know. I'd understand. Yeah, I don't know, Matt. Be careful, dude. I don't know. Like, seriously, you we're going to have to time you out if you keep up the caps. Scientific mystery. You got to You got to Please, Oink. please, please work on that habit. Oink. <laughs> That opened a flow bridge for us. He's also just staying it. I think that's enough rust to cobble up your tractor globe joint. Are we leaving then? No. I'm ready when you are. No, I'm getting food. So that was the co well. I'm glad I got the combat system. Oh, more boba nets. I would like to make a boba net dish too. That'd be good. Where, where is this? This rust keeps going. So I'm missing. I'm missing a connection with that rust. Ah, oh, probably that. Do you think we'll have enough? We never have enough. True, truer the words have never been spoken. If lizards oink, it needs to be fattened. Because pigs need to be pigs. Yeah, I could U turn or I could just stop for a second, which works pretty well too. What was that? Sorry, I forgot that we could drift in order to turn. <laughs> this one smells weird. Chuck it then. Are you insane? <laughs> Look, it smells weird. It probably is fine to eat. <laughs> you know, we have immune systems for a reason. It's fine. It's a little off, but. <laughs> oh, let's save this. What does she want from us? Let's save this one too. Wait, what's that middle? Oh, it's the bug. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> rush mode. Huh. We do rush mode, apparently. Are you all right? You started it. Yes. So what's what's my health? Like... Also, the whole letting go thing right. doesn't always like work. That? Oh, it's sometimes you. Oh, I see. I see. I see. That. Jump. Ah. Sometimes I gotta press an extra button. I realize now. Great job. There we go. You're welcome. One to go. Keep that. You didn't like that too much. Hmm. Anyways, can get back up. I kind of figured. I kind of figured. We're that good. I like the victory music. It's kind of nice little snazzy little beat. You still have yet to shield. I will shield next combat, I suppose, if I get that far. I you, you shield have yet to shield. You say to the guy who normally fights it with the attitude of, if I defeat them, then I don't have to defend. I, that's how I play games. <laughs> oh, a cave. Kind of. Oh, I, I look, if I have the option to build a glass cannon in, like, an action RPG, where I can do a lot of damage, but if I take a hit, I'm fucked. Uh, I usually do it. I find that very exciting and fun. Blast from range shield is so you have one character to do, and they will defend both characters. Oh, really? So how, how? I do find it odd, though. I can't find it. I still can't find a health bar. Okay, there's our health. I, oh, there's like oh, there's like skills we can upgrade. By the way, um, how do I tell my health while in a combat though? That kind of worries me. I don't see a health bar in combat.
color of the boots. The boots? That seems very imprecise, but alright. Oh, oh, I back attacked. Okay. Bam. Your turn. I got this. So if I shield with one of them. Are you okay? Okay. I'm... Done and chill. Oh, I think Keep I just said. You got this? So I can. I do. So I can put up a shield oh, for no, both you... of us. Oh, I see. Yeah. You started it. Go, go, K. I understand. Perfect. What? Ooh, take why, that. why is it sometimes when my attacks doesn't go off? Like what? What? What's going on when it doesn't work? Like sometimes. You, some, oh, maybe I just have to. Maybe it's because I have to wait. Your turn. I'm on it. One down. Oh, I can pass by all when they're all down. You make a good team. Because oh, because attack was in queue with the enemy and thus it stopped my attack. I was getting very confused about that. Basically, the reason it didn't trigger is because it had to wait. I kind of missed my U-turn. We'll do better next time. But then I got confused by that and tried to redo the attack, which wasted my time. Like I immediately takes a nap after that. Huh. This is where we came from. Oh. All right. I know. I, I don't. I don't know. I'm just gonna say I know. I do like these characters too. Pretty cool. Certainly likable. Oh, hello. If combat's the worst part of the game. Yeah, it's fine enough. So we'll complete this run, and then we'll move on to another game. Complete this area, basically. I have a good one. Yeah, it's not a U-turn. I like to just stop. It lets me use the camera a bit. Oh, what's, what's this? What, what's up with this fella? Oh, this is interesting. Hello. You're like, uh, well, you kind of look like a Pokeball, I'll be honest. A bugwing doggo? I don't know if it's a doggo. Oh, oh no, if I'm scratching. Okay, well. That looks bad. Shield up. Get back. You started it. Let's get it over with. And done. You? Yep, I saw that. One to go. I'll keep them at bay. Oh no. Are you alright? Ha! What's the what's I the number of that? Oh, okay. Let's hit together. I don't even think you felt that. Okay, blast then, obviously. Okay, so he hates this. Okay. Target left. Oh girl. Huh. Let's get it over with. And done. I see a little bit of Kate in this, but the 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 face gives me a expression of honestly. I see kind of a, a bovine or kind of face out of the. I don't know. It kind of seems more like it's got ram horns. It's, I'm feeling ungulate. I'm feeling a bit ungulate details here, but also not with the paws and the build. I guess the body doesn't. The body seems kind of like canid. I'm not sure. It's a mix. Yeah, it feels a bit cow-like though in the face. A cow dog, perhaps? I mean, it's not a terrible combination. <laughs> Sorry, I'm kind of struggling. Oh, they're following me now. I should have drifted a little. Cow dog is a blend that we should see more of. Of course, I suppose I'm just saying that because I like the idea of a dog without her. What? Straight ahead, an aerial flow thread. 
Oh, yeah. Do you think it could carry us all the way up there? Only one way to find out. But I thought we couldn't... Did we miss, or did it break? It broke. Well, I technically missed it, but also we can't hover on those, I thought, so... It doesn't actually matter. I mean, we tried earlier and... A uh, fly one, it didn't work, so... Utters are very hard. Can't have her for long on them, yeah. Another thing from home. How many do you think Axanova built before they realized it wouldn't work? I guess they knew what they were doing. Having worked for them, I can tell you they don't just throw money around. Knowing my mom, I'm not surprised. Still though, it shouldn't take years of research and observation to realize that this planet is scattered around like a jigsaw puzzle. You don't just see this and think, ooh, this place is nice. We should settle it. That's what we did. But we didn't have much of a choice. Why did my mom never mention any of this to me? I don't think Axanova wins colonization contracts on the regular. Those buildings are kind of old. Your mom may not have been head of the company then. She may not have been with the company at all. Yeah. That's possible. Still, it's weird. Agreed. I guess we'll figure it out eventually. Hmm. So the they have the another bit of rust for your big organization oh, settled this cool. planet, but it didn't make much I sense why they did. Oh, two of them are sleeping still. I would have probably attacked the uh Shielding. Perfect. Eat it. Your turn. Uh. Ooh. You're safe. Uh. Bye bye. You go, girl. I, don't, I wish I could choose a target, I'll be honest. Wait, what would stop me from just shielding over and over again with one character to like? You know what to do. I got this. Are you I mean, okay? there is a number, I guess. So I guess I can't shield forever. One to go. But like, it occurs to me if I don't mind lowering my damage output, could I just guard everything? That looks bad. That's gotta hurt. My shield is out. Oh, okay. No, I think my shield out is, is, is a notification, like, I have my shield up. My shield is out, my shield is out and working. Oh, is it less damage? Oh, it's a defense. I wasn't sure if it was nullifying all damage or not. I have to say, the, 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 the thing that's confusing about this is that's just tell you how much damage I'm taking. Ready? What's ready? Oh, an upgrade's ready. Oh, I think I can kind of tell that we're kind of beat up, though, because of our... Yeah, look, we can tell we're injured by just walking around. Look at us. We're both kind of fucked up, I guess. Oh, we're not that fucked up. Um. Oh, we can... Oh, it looks like we will be repairing our nest. Used for quiet nests or capping areas. Oh, I can't use it even here. All right. Okay, cool. What about the upgrades? How do I... I have full bar so I can upgrade it. It said I was ready. How do I do it? Or do I have to get back to the nest for that, too? I made a big deal about being ready, but I don't think I can interact with it. Another one. What? Oh, it's not, it's not evil. Never mind. Oh, oh God, well, I was gonna. I got stuck. Well, whatever. Well, I didn't mean to rush, actually. Well, whatever. This one's ready. Cover me. I accidentally rushed. No way. Done and done. One to go. Go, oh, girl. Oh, come on. Oh, it's healing. Interesting. Uh -huh. You go, girl. 
Okay, why did it get to attack? I know I what to do. <laughs> the animation glitched on that. Well, it can't be a Heller. It can't be a charm. It can't be me playing a game unless I find a glitch somewhere. Are you okay? You know, I am starting to get tired of being beat up by every critter that comes around. Should I carry you? No, that's fine. I can walk on my own. Although if you have some heavy-duty pain meds, I, I wouldn't turn them down. All right. I guess it's time for me to do what I do best. Snuggle? I was more <laughs> thinking about gathering strange plants with medicinal properties. We already have some medic kits. Oh yeah, we do. Then I guess we just need to find a place to lay low and care for your injuries. If I was going to complain about one thing with the voice acting, I'm noticing the dude, his mic quality isn't as high as the ladies. It's an observation. It's, it's not that different, but I do notice it. It's more of a nitpick, honestly. Sorry, I forgot that we could drift in order to turn. It's not the it's not a problem with his voice work, it's just a problem with his mic quality. How did I miss that? What? Wait. Hmm. Oh wait. Oh, oh I'm out of flow. I'm out of flow. For once, I'm actually out of it. <laughs> I, I basically stopped picking it up because I know, because I, I know I was like barely ever losing it. So I stopped carrying. I need to start carrying again, I guess. Seems like that's the highest we'll get. That wasn't too far off. Look, there's another bridge over there. Ugh, I wanted to go all the way up. We'll have to lay off the apple dews then. <laughs> too fat. <laughs> Still no. We're not going higher with these boots on. No. Well, anyway, let me go ahead and fix that. Was it over here, I think? Or up there? Ah, there it is. Oh. This is so frustrating. Lucky for us, they're not all like this. I have to say, it's much nicer this way. Watch out. I'm not sure our boots will fare too well in the water. Oh, could they get damaged? No way. They're waterproof. But you won't exactly grip the track underwater. Thank goodness they're waterproof. They seem kind of important. Oh, so you really heard an I know. Uh, are we eating soon? Are you already hungry? I'm just looking ahead. She's injured, so naturally, food will fix that. <laughs> I'm trying to get enough boba nuts to make the mills you guys want me to make. I'm not sure we have enough yet, but maybe we do. Sorry, I kind of missed my U-turn. We'll do better next time. I'm not even trying to U-turn. Shush. I prefer not. You probably have more than enough. Okay, well, I'm gonna hold you to that. Alright, let's go to the next area then. Uh, which one's the next area? I do want that one though. Well, no, it doesn't really matter. Isn't this the bridge we took to get okay. here? Okay. It is. I mean, it'd be nice to be a person that understands, to, that can remember where he's been, but unfortunately that's not me. <laughs> We're not falling from too high. What if I wanted a high fall? A 
share okay. those. That's probably enough bubble nuts. I recommend going back to the nest. Wait, I can go back? I mean, well, I could I literally can't go back. She was like, well, we've been that direction. Or was I able to keep going? Actually, I didn't. I didn't bother to check. I just assumed I was forced to go forward. It's officially night. Oh. That, that was fast, alright. The discourage she I don't know, the game always was giving me a very discouraging, like, well that's the way we came from. What? Like a tremor. No. I wasn't paying attention. I hope I imagined it. Alright, I'll go back then, I guess. It's just that when... Mm, that seems like bad player guidance in a little bit. Into the back. Like, think about it, man. It, every time... Like, watch. Watch when I approach this. We know what's that way. So I can go back. But they, they discourage me for going back with the words they say. We've been that way. We know what's that way. So I'm like, oh, okay, I can't go this way. You know, like, that's a natural Sorry, response, you know? I'm kind of struggling. I think, I, I feel, should have drifted a little. I feel like that's a natural response I'm, I'm doing, where I, uh, I'm like, well, I guess I can't go this way, because they're, they're talking, to, they're very discouraged, they're talking very discouragedly about going backwards, so I can't go that way. But no, no, actually, they, I can go back. I, I just assumed that to mean I couldn't, so I just was like, oh, okay, never, sorry, 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 I won't do this. <laughs> You know what? You know what would have fixed this nice and easy. You know what would have fixed this nice and easy if uh, when when uh, when when we had that little cutscene because we were injured. That would have been a great time for them to say, you know, we can go back to the nest if we need to. I think we've got everything we need to mold a joint for the tractor glow. All right then, ready when you are. Oh wait, if I go back now, I'm gonna. You. I can't wait to get going. Why? Well, I wanted to eat. I didn't hey, want to distract. I'm go. sorry to say it. I can't go any further without eating something. Same here. We need to stay strong, little tractor globe. Well, I didn't really want to do that yet, but oh, god damn it, guys! I can't because it wants me to do the tractor globe thing. Stay strong, little tractor. All right, you know what? Fuck it, we're going forward again. <laughs> I'm not allowed in. I have to do the tractor globe. I'm not doing the tractor globe. That'll go fast next day. I don't want to do that yet. I want to do the. I want to go over here and see the thingy. So screw it. <laughs> screw it, man. Oh, wait, wait. So what's the plan exactly? What? This is the path we took when we. Oh. Oh, Blute. Ah, oh, Blute. I might have been. Should we? Whatever works for you. I mean, there's more peppers. Now I want to. I want to forge ahead, honestly. <laughs> Look, these two are stuck. Oh god, no, I didn't mean to fall down. Ah. Ah. Ah, I say, ah. No, I don't actually have a problem with the combat. Like, Car Hat said the worst part of the game is the combat. I disagree. I think the worst part of the game is the... It's, it's lacking a bit of intuitiveness, and I, I think it bothers me a little bit. Oh, more bubbles are here. Can we go back the other way? As you wish. I think up ahead's the boss. Yeah, I'll give it a shot. I'm not... I'm a... I can take a hit, maybe. It's, it's fine. It, yeah, I found it kind of odd. Like, once I clear the rust from an area, I feel like that's... A, it just seems weird. It just seems really weird that I can't, at the very least, just use a medkit when the area is cleared out from rust and the enemies are cleared out from an area. Like, if an island is completely devoid of threats, why can't I heal? Is what I'm... Is what I'm asking, you know? It's kind of weird. Extra mills equals extra health kits? Oh, okay. But whatever. Like I said, I want to check out the area we were at before, so... What was that? Sorry, I forgot that we could drift in order to turn. 
Oh, we actually traveled quite far, I just realized. Alright, let's see. Yeah, that's actually my main issue, just... Definitely feel like you should be able to... Uh, we are decidedly not equipped heal. for aerial flow threads. We're gonna need... But I guess, I mean, Cappy Spots is nice and all, but... Is that a Cappy Spot? That thing where I'm facing? Maybe that's a Cappy Spot. I'll just go immediately over to that. Gosh, I didn't need to go back to the nest. It was right here. This thing does not look very natural. Yeah. It's probably satellite debris or a rocket oh, well. propeller. This part of space is a real dump. <laughs> I don't know. This stone circle around it still looks weird to me. This? These aren't stones. They're Brian's Mollus Molus. Bloofs, for short. Bloofs? Yeah, because when you sit on them, it goes... Ooh, I like. They're very amusing, except for the part where they release poisonous gas when you do that. Huh. <sighs> I think I could fall asleep right here. You? <laughs> uh, yep, that's a... <laughs> you. Who? What? I told you I'm not going back. Go bloot yourselves! You... It's me. I think you fell asleep. I think Bloot is the cutest oh, space expedition I've ever heard. These Bloofs are way too comfortable. You can't leave me here. <laughs> if we ever need to sleep under the stars, we'll know where to come. And we do. Let's uh heal. <sighs> if that doesn't get not sure about you. Good. Oh, we could share the bed. That's good. So can I cook? I can. Right here, here it's time. We're gonna do. So it takes five. That means we can probably do that and that, and then we can. Uh, uh, wait. Oh, it's one or the other. Oh, I can't mix the two. That's a shame. How do I? Uh, wait. Wait. No, no, no. Hold on. How do I select the peppers? No, 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 that's not the problem. I do, I do realize my mistake there, but how do I select the peppers? The bumper did that. We don't have a bumper. You can't spice food and capping? Come on. Oh, well, let's make double nuts. Boba Paray. So I can do all the normal cooking, but I can't add pepper. <laughs> So, so cooking is like normal cooking out in the fields, like cooking in a in a in a, in a kitchen, huh. except for you can't add seasonings. You know what we should have packed. That's random. Marshmallows. Marshmallows. My guitar. You have a guitar? Well, yeah. Where is it? At my house, on top. Well, I guess these days I can't really. Call I, I just thought, like logically speaking, it's kind of odd. Even say That's it's my guitar. I didn't we literally know have play. the peppers. I don't see why we can't to use them. To be honest, I wouldn't really say that I play. My mother's had me take courses when I was little. I took them for two years, and then I got tired. I couldn't cook more. It didn't let it me. Again. It was grayed out. I even called it. I actually held it. Old timey instrument. I held down the cook more <laughs> option. and didn't do anything. But you can't. It didn't work. You know, I was holding it down. Everything. That's why I just paused at that menu for a while. Oh, I would have played along on the harmonica. Because you play the harmonica? No. But since we're imagining things, let's just run with it. Yeah, you're right. I can already picture it. We could have founded a band. Yeah, I'm getting pestered a lot here. Band on source. A Yuki. It's an anagram of you and K. <laughs> yeah, I got that. I was thinking more along the lines of... 
Oink and his orchestra. <laughs> Oink and his orchestra. Oh, Oink is in the band too? Of course, on vocals. That squeaked nicely. <laughs> of course. Why not? Bite the rust. Bite the rust. <laughs> not bad. Mm, dual flow. Acrocillin blues. Where the heart is. How long is this going on? A mare. <laughs> Apple dew stew. Oh yeah, I definitely like that. We are so apple dew stew now. We'll bring the house down. I think we have enough rust to plug the tractor wheel. Okay then. What are we waiting for? Oh yeah, actually. We just tore down the camp. No. No. Oh, wait. In camp, was there an option to upgrade? The, you know, the stat thing? But because I chose food, it immediately put me to bed afterwards. Oh, there wasn't. Uh, okay. I'm nowhere near tired. Alright, fine. We, I was going to try to make another meal, but I guess it's one of those. Have to cook logically when you're hungry and not just eat when you're not hungry. But eating when you're not hungry is fun. It's a great leisurely activity. Oh, so you guys were talking about a boss? I was, I'm kind of intrigued. That's why I wanted Sorry. to come back. I kind of missed my U-turn. We'll do better next time. No, well, we have two other dishes we need to make. I just made nothing but boba. Did I just put nothing but nuts in? We gotta do a combination of nuts and the other. And then of course I have the pepper. Well, of course I. Sure this one is right? I probably won't do this to this session though. If I come back to this game, that's when I will do it. You know, floating islands are cool and all, but they never make sense as to when they have water on them. It should just flow off, and there you go, no more water. Indeed. What? A break? <sighs> we just took a break. If you told me one day I'd be millions of lumsack from the apiary watching rocks flying by. Oh, Beautiful, cutscene break. Gotcha. <laughs> I'd say intriguing. I'm trying to figure out how it works. I'm pretty sure you don't know how nucleosynthesis works either. But you can still appreciate the stars in the sky. That's true. <sighs> it could be worse. Yeah. Actually, this is all thanks to the matchmaker. What? Think about it. Imagine the matchmaker had put us together. We would have spent our boring lives in the apiary without surprise. And we would have never ended up here. Together. Watching rocks flying by. There is no yeah no yeah she they are talking about stars when there aren't stars. I don't care about these rocks. All I Look, care I, about is being with I you. I think we here in the apiary, in deep space, or at the bottom of a hole. It's all the same to me. True, it's, it's all so decorative. Sorry. What are we should have been here during night like originally? Remember how we caught here yeah, during night and then I left and then it's not night? I might have broken the cutscene. Phrase you use in sciences? Oh yeah, negligible amounts. Possibly. I don't know. Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. It's hard to tell. That was the last one. It was talking about stars. It was. All right. Where's the next path forward? washed my hair this morning. Now you washed it again now. Oh, 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 never mind. You know what? 
Walking is nice too. It is. That way, you have time to enjoy all the little bugs crawling around. Bugs. I'm not seeing any bugs. That means we're walking too fast. Slow down. I, I'm sorry. I know I saw some ingredients, and I'm just trying to figure sorry. out where they were. I'm kind of struggling. I should have drifted a little. At least I thought I did. Oh well, whatever. Uh, path, path, ingredients. I already picked. And okay, so that's. I think this is a new path. Oh, beer! You got a gold. You got a gold. The silly one. Nicely done. Hey, what's that? Hi. Hold on. I'll fight I you in a second. Oh, they really do chase you, don't they? They eventually give up, or Whew. we lost him. Da, 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 da. Surprise. Started it. No, you didn't. Not too soon. What? Oh wait, what? I need to weaken it. You're not You're set. Okay, it's fine. I got you back. Sweet. Okay, let's get past fight. Great job. Thank you for picking all these up here. Chill. Uh -huh. I'll keep Ooh. Oh, Blute. Hey. You? Yep. Saw that. Look, look, look. I got this. Well done. One to go. Uh, go, girl. Blammo. Wow. Target luck. Oh, yeah. Oops. Hey. Boom, baby. Bam. This one's ready. On a turn. There we go. I got this. There you go. <laughs> We're that good. There's one thing that's bothering me. The meter up there, the meter that lets you upgrade. Question to car, specifically. The meter is full, I can do an upgrade. I'm still getting fights done. Is the meter technically filling in the background again? Or am I losing all of this experience, basically? Basically, if I fill the meter past full, does it say, does it remember? Does it remember the extra experience I've gathered? Or am I wasting it? Carries over. Okay. It, it, it always worries me when I'm like, okay, the meter is full and I'm still gathering more of the, the thing that fills the meter. Am I wasting it? Like, I always wonder, is this a waste, you know? Oh, another hey, one. Are you sure they canceled the colonization? Because we've come across a lot of infrastructure at this point. Because it's pretty damning if a game doesn't, you, you know, if it wastes, if it wastes it. Could it be that the archives are mine? Hmm. Let's go inside. Uh, of course they could be. Uh, no? Okay, that's kind of perplexing. If there's a doorway, why not go in? We're looking for resources, right? And more rust. Ooh, shy rust. Never have too much. I got a shy one. Found the shy variant of the rust. Well, you guys want me to blast the bugs for some reason. This one's mine. Oh, I messed up. Shielding. Perfect. Oh. Ow. I, I, went to, I went to hit the... No. Uh, Why didn't you hit one. the lizard? Thank you. Yep. I got that's, this. that's up there. Sorry, I'm just a little annoyed there. It, you can't choose your target. It's really throwing me off, I'll be honest. Ah, oh, oh, okay. Bugs. Yeah, that's what I thought. That 
looks bad. Ugh. Are you all right? Your turn. I got this. Got this? You didn't figure out how to power the door. Oh, fair enough. You always go back and upgrade. No, I can't, Car. I actually can't. That's the thing, we actually tried that, and it didn't work. I mean, I can if I want to advance the cutscenes, but... But that would probably end the day. You have to fix your house, then upgrade. My house is slanted! I could upgrade in a slanted house. It's not that big a deal. Or at least it should be. Eat up a flow thread? Sure did. That's probably why these creatures don't seem affected by the rust. Good for them. Well, that's I silly. I just want to have more options. Us, namely. <laughs> I do hate it when a game locks off, like doing a thing. Do need rust? When of it's, always it's like, well, you need to do this thing before you can access this feature. It's like, oh, oh go, whoa, 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 hello, hello. I'm not sure what his toy did to him, but I wouldn't like to be in its place. <laughs> Seems to be a like a Hold little on. beacon. Isn't that what? Let's get a closer look. Doesn't sound like a good idea. It's a big boy. I'm gonna worry about big boy in a minute. Hello. Hit that. You started it. This one's ready. Yep. Okay. I got your back. Sweet. Ugh. You. You like that? Meet my boyfriend. I'll keep them at bay. No way. Oh, okay. Keep that. Nice one. Get back. Ugh. Chill. Okay. Uh, let's get it over with. And done. You? Yep. Stop shielding. Perfect. Okay. One to go. Uh -huh. Are you okay? You know, I, I feel like doing the attacks together should do more damage, but it doesn't. Like, I feel like if we hit the enemy at the same time, it should do some bonus damage, but it doesn't do that. I feel like that would have been a nice feature, given that this game's about the relationship of these two. If they attack together, it should do more damage, because it kind of makes sense for the relationship aspect. Um, but it doesn't actually work that way. There's more. Dual attacks are a thing... Yeah, but I should be able to do this by synchronizing the two attacks. I'm glad that there are actual dual attacks, probably later. But that should count as a dual attack, you know? <laughs> I find the progressive is more beneficial than harmful. I, I, I understand that card, but like... How do I put this, right? If a game presents an environment for me to explore, right? And then it tells me... Oh, but you should really not explore it right now. You should go back and, you know, do story stuff. It's like, well, but this environment is available. And I would like to explore it. This is charm. It doesn't really progress for us. Thank you. Sunly actually says it. Somebody's like, hey, this is this is this is the charm motif. And yes, it is. It is a very much it is very much how I work, usually. Also, another reason I'm not doing it, because I'd like to get to another game. So if I go ahead and just progress, rather than backing off for story, well, um, yeah, that's, where that, we came from. that's better for the fact Don't of changing scared. games. We we're just trying to take a closer look at you. Under my point of view, if if, uh, if if I have a large area open up to me, I should probably have all the features to take a bit of benefit of those of that area. Can I catch this guy? I legitimately wonder. Like sometimes it feels like I can corner him. Like right now. Like look, look at that. Like I felt like I almost cut him off there. I feel like he's a little too fast, though. Now, if I play a Metroid, like I am completely complacent to like, okay, I can't progress Sorry. right now. I kind of missed my U-turn. Like I can't make that jump. I'll have to come back later. I understand that. That's fine. That's fine. But what I'm saying is, if I do have access to an area, I'd like to go ahead and check it out. If I don't, if if something is logically barring me off, then, yeah, I'll go. Is giving me a great recipe idea. I'll go go get no you know. Spoilers. I'll go get the. Uh, Necessary materials first, or whatever. 
I'm trying to figure out how to get rid of the rest of the rust. There's kind of deposits all over the place here. My point is though, if you give me a large area to explore, expect me to explore it, that's all. If you're if you're like, here's a large area to explore, but you really shouldn't be exploring this right now, then I'm kind of feeling like I'm giving getting mixed messages. It's like it's like presenting somebody something and then telling them they can't have it. It's like, well, what? You know, like it's a mixed message at that point. Especially for somebody like me. They went out expressly with control with doing the tractical. That's true, but you also have to consider. Okay, there's still rust. Where the hell is the last deposit of rust? I'm missing like I'm missing like a. You see that zygoptera? Yeah. Depend. What's a zygoptera? A dragonfly. Then no. Oh okay. But yeah, the since the rust is still hanging around, I'm trying to figure out like. Maybe I have to take out the big guy. For the rust to go away. Perhaps that's it. All right, take out the big guy. It's yep. not ready. Hi, big guy. Now, let me get behind him. He's distracted, so I feel like I get a back attack either way. But nope. Okay. It would seem that he's not going to share his toy. What did I tell you? Cover me. Yeah, blast. We should coordinate our attacks. Dodge this one. All right. Same okay. attack on three. There's a double attack. Missed. Oh, oh, I see. There's a. It seems like my attacks aren't landing. Maybe if we both attacked at the same time. I see. I think we found the right technique. Ready? Go, go, go! Didn't realize there was a quick time. I'm sure he felt that. What about duo impact? Ready when you are. All set. That works. You want some more? Same attack, same time. It didn't flinch. Oh, whoops. You for me to attack. I messed that up. <laughs> Try to see something. Oh, that does more damage, yeah. Ready when you are. Ready. You go, girl. Yeah, did, I actually was looking at that. I broke the animation again. <laughs> Oof, we got quite beat up, but we did it. Oh yeah. Oh shit. I forgot about pacify. I forgot about pacify. <laughs> I kind of forgot about pacify. <laughs> I was just like, well, it's a boss. I'm done. Well, that's what happens when they get up, I guess. Glad they don't recover all their health. Who's next? The end. He left this toy behind. That's not a toy. Looks like a robot. A robot? Almost. It's a Draca, drone for autonomous cartography. Very old tech. The kind we sent out to Beauty before it was integrated to the apiary. Oh. Seems like they pondered integrating Source for a while as well. I wonder why they changed their minds. It could be the fact that this planet is scattered like a puzzle. Probably was a factor. The Draca may hold some answers. You're kidding. No, really. Stuff from that era was built tough. We may be able to boot it back up. Hmm. Mm. Okay. I mean... I might have spoken a bit quickly. The flow circuits are completely fried. But... But, 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 but look at what I was able to salvage. I'm gonna comment on what Key said once they stop talking for a sec. Oh, okay, cool. So Key, kind of ironic that after you complained because you're avoiding the game guiding you the enemy the entire fight was a tutorial for team attacks. True, but at the same time, according to Carr, the game wasn't guiding me towards the enemy. The game was guiding me towards the antigraph. So I would have spent even longer not knowing about team attacks if I had been doing normal progression. So technically speaking, I found about team attacks faster than I was supposed to. Uh, anyways, the grab chips don't seem to be damaged. I should be able to make them compatible with our boots by tweaking the connectors a bit. Whoa, 
Even better, the mapping module is also working perfectly. But I'm understanding the pace of this game, yes. If I plug that into the glove's power source, it should... Boom! This should be very helpful for finding our way around the bits of land. <laughs> you never cease to impress me. Also, I would have received the map as soon. These old machines are plain and simple astronautical engineering. Not like the new stuff with boronic nano components everywhere. I, I will pet you, even though you hurt me a lot. Hello. Oh, but I can't interact with them. So that way we can ah, okay. the different bits. Okay, so yeah. and with this, we can make our way back to the nest a lot easier. Hey, look! It says there's another bridge in this area. Here's my thoughts, right? That way we can test if your thingy works. So if this map lets me go back to the nest easier, here's a crazy idea. If I wasn't supposed to rest this far before returning with the anti-grab. Why not give me the map once I had enough for the anti for the uh, thing we need to use back in the nest? Why not give me the map the moment I have enough for that? That way it's directly encouraging and making it easier for me to return to the nest. Rather than making me feel like, well, I want to keep going ahead. Because it's not really fun to backtrack, you know? So, it would have been smarter if the map was a gift, was a reward for receiving the um, components I needed to go move the nest, rather than being something I forged ahead and grabbed. Other than the fact the path until now has been linear, doesn't matter. The, the fact the map, the map makes it easier to find non-linear paths, yes, but it also lets you quick travel, I believe. That's what, that's what I'm talking about right now. The map lets you, yeah, quick travel, right? At least that's what I've been hearing. I don't know how to do it. I have a lot of rust. Sorry, I'm kind of struggling. I should have drifted a little. Yeah, she's in really bad shape. It's growing, slowly but surely. So, Car, you want to talk to me about the? Uh... Plenty for the estimate of rust. Map component is not true. True. I know mechanically they are different. Like, or contextually they are different. They're like. Seems like the radar is working. Uh, is it? Are you surprised? Oh. Oh! That's not so much a fast travel, it's just a faster way back. Game is a force of to be pressed try petting again. Oh my god! It seems like there's always something to be hmm. nitpicking on. <laughs> this is weird. What is? It looks like there's also a pre recorded location. I don't know. In that case, we definitely have to. I do feel like sometimes there's a little too much dialogue. Okay, so there's a mysterious marked location. I mean, you're probably right, so I just. Ugh. This game isn't flowing with me quite right, honestly. Clearly, because everybody's getting frustrated about what I'm doing. Alright, where's Big Guy? I assume he's still hanging out. Oh, did all the stuff come back because I left the area for a second? That's interesting. And big guy might be gone now. I don't know. Where was he? <laughs> I mean, once my attitude is simply car that if you give me that you if you are are now opening the map to me, then give me the functions necessary to enjoy that. Like right off the bat. Yes, that's my attitude. If I'm if I'm locked to an area. For tutorial land, if I'm locked to an area for tutorials, then go ahead and give me what you feel like you want to give me. But once you open things up to me, I should have access to things. Oh, he is over here. Okay. That's just how I am from a gameplay perspective. And also, just to verify this, scratch, yes, I can scratch this boy, but not this boy. <laughs> He's just not, what was that? not scratchable. Sorry, I forgot that we could drift in order to turn. I guess here's another thing. Here's another thing. I don't see any games do this, right? I don't think I've seen any games do this. I don't even know how exactly you could implement it, so I'm not exactly saying I know that this would fix everything. But here's a crazy idea. 
if a game does has some interesting features that will be very useful later on, they expect me to do story progression for it or whatever. Be nice if there was a little bit of a note somewhere saying, hey, by the way, soon you're going to unlock this, so keep that in mind, you know? So that way I know, like, this rather than... Where we came from, there's, isn't there's it? a lot of games where... There's a lot of games where I make something harder on myself, effectively, by uh, doing something a hard way before just a bit later I would get an easier way of doing it. And if I had only just been told, like, hey, there will be an easier way to do this soon, then I would have probably not done the hard thing. Isn't that Oink? Oh, it's Oink. Oh, he came back! He came to our island. Definitely him. That's Oink. What's happening, big guy? Why are you here? You missed us, didn't you? I bet he felt lonely on his empty eyelid. You do realize that we can't take you along on our journeys, don't you? Why not? That would be too exhausting. I mean, for he could come. I mean, hang on the nest. But you can stay with us next to the nest if you want. <laughs> no funny business, though. How did I get here? It flew. On the flow, maybe. I don't know. It's possible. <laughs> alright, alright. We'll repair this thing for the... Oh, okay. So? Well, it fits. That's a good sign. Let's get this ball rolling. What? What? Haven't you heard of that one either? Oh, no. I have. I'm still going back to it what I said earlier, Carl. Really old-fashioned saying. At, 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 near the beginning of this, the when I was complimenting this game on its That's story worse. structure... The way it was presented, story. I uh. <laughs> okay. When I was earlier complimenting this game on its story structure, I said that was a good way of doing it because it encourages gameplay for the game. Because a game should focus on its gameplay first, and then the rest can be focused on afterwards. So while I do understand your argument, Car, at the same time, going back to that statement I said at the beginning, there there is ways of not breaking immersion but also focusing on the gameplay. Focusing on the gameplay functionality and smoothness, specifically. That worked out. It worked! We did it. Now, we just need to fix up the wings and the turbine and the hypo propellers and... Don't be so cynical. Getting the nest out of the crevasse was quite a feat. Huh? No, don't get me wrong. I am genuinely delighted. I love fixing things up, but I don't think we need to get started right away. <sighs> it's, it's, it's in a slightly better position now. Actually, how far? I assume we moved it very far away from the cliff, right? Because that's a much safer idea. Come back. We're not going to eat you. I mean, why not? Why would they think that? Okay, it's still kind of close to a cliff, though. Aren't we getting close to lunchtime? I would have put it like... Don't ask me. I'm always hungry. If I were them, I would have put it like... Somewhere around here, sort of against. This would have been a much better spot. I don't know. I don't know. This is more narrative focused than gameplay focused. And a lot of games are. Mm. Oh, this isn't gonna go very far without rust. Oh, I need. Okay, so I actually have a ton of rust for different things, but I. Okay, so I need the. I need the components though, like the actual unique components. But what up here? I have a lot of resources already. Do you want to come in? All right, come on. I know. I know. I do the boss unlock team attacks, let alone the other goodies. Yeah, that's the that's the thing. Like it's it's okay when things unlock naturally, but it has to work within the gameplay's flow. And you guys were complaining about how I was playing, which indicates that there's a flow issue. You know. Um. Because it's okay if stuff just happens to unlock Sorry. as you play. That can actually be really nice. I'm not saying that's bad. I'm not even saying that's bad. I'm saying uh, randomly unlocking things as you play, and just being like, "Oh, I got this now." It's it's f that's fine. That's actually a nice surprise uh, a lot of times. But it, it, if 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 you just went and did something that you should have done because you didn't know you were going to unlock stuff in a certain way, that's when it becomes a problem. And according to you guys, I've been doing a lot of things I should have done. So. I say according to you guys, because I don't have a problem with the way I play a game, typically, but... Well, you guys do, so... You know. <laughs> yeah, I didn't have to fight it, but of course I'm gonna fight it. I'm me. Come on, give me your boots. Once I plug in these chips, they'll be like a whole new pair. I can barely figure out left and right as they are. Let's look around a bit. 
So, how are the repairs coming along? Uh, I've done everything I can, but I'm missing some parts and can't move on. What kind of parts? A bit of everything. The thing is that I'm not looking for very precise models or anything. I can always adapt, but I'm still gonna need some more It's a good gear. game, though. Honestly, this is a good game. It's just... Hope we'll find everything we need in this area, then. When it comes to a narrative-heavy game, I always ha I I will explain this. I have an innate fear of narration advancing story and events before I'm ready in video games. You ever have you ever played a game where you're like, I'm gonna explore this town. I got to a new town. I'm gonna explore it. You start exploring it, and then you walk into the inn, and the character's like, Oh, guys, we need to have a big cutscene before we get on the airship in the morning, which is also a scripted cutscene. And then you go to sleep in the cut scripted cutscene, and then you wake up in the scripted cutscene, and then your guys go on the airship and you leave the town. And I'm like, No, I didn't finish exploring the town though. <laughs> that really gets me. <laughs> that that sort of situation really gets me, and that situation is why. That situation is why I'm very leery. That's actually, th that actually is the reason that I first started doing the thing where I try to skip, like I try to do everything before advancing the plot. That's why I do that. Because I'm always scared the plot will cut me off from things I want to do. So that's why I always try to skip the plot in games until I feel like I'm satisfied. Like I fully explored this town. I fully, I fought every enemy in the area. I've looked around all the fields and dungeons I can get access, you know, so okay, now I can, you know, advance. Um, because I'm always worried the game is going to rip me away from things I want to do. Um, <laughs> it's an innate fear of games. <laughs> because okay. it, nothing sucks as much as yes. being excited to explore something and then something. you can't because you advance its plot. Did we already eat everything? Yeah. Also, uh, to, to specify something earlier, by the way. First off, peppers. <laughs> Alright, good. Second off, nuts, because it's new. I want to demonstrate something. So I can I can cook this, right? This new food. I'm gonna address something earlier. Now earlier when I was camping, I was getting some people I was getting heckled by somebody about how I didn't cook more. I actually held down the right button and nothing happened. If you notice now, I don't know how you didn't notice this earlier, but I immediately picked up on this. The eat now button was blue. The cook more button was gray. Here in the ha here in the nest though, both buttons are blue. It's a normal gameplay mechanic. If a button is grayed out, you can't use it. So <laughs> I knew for a fact, even before I pressed the button, but I did press the button in fairness. I pressed right on the D-pad that's checked at the time too. But whoever heckled me then, Learn cues, <laughs> you know? Well, it's fine, but like after the heckling, they were still not convinced. They were like, well, I still think you didn't do it right, basically. And I was like, well, I did. This is a new one, right? Yeah. That looks actually interesting. Blaze Boba. All right, we're done now. I'm going to eat. Because I think that's all the dishes I can currently make. Because I can't mix it's three things. It's a regressive dish, isn't it? Regressive? Why'd you say that? Well, that's a lot of fat and carbs. That's good. You're usually more fine dining. Mm, that's true. There's more if you want. Definitely. <laughs> yeah, see? <laughs> okay, they are even more convinced me to go get some McDonald's 18, or something. 19, 20. Keep on going, my love. You're strong. 21. 22. You know I'm able to count on my own, right? Yeah, but I like to watch when you do push-ups. So they work out the... Do <laughs> like they feel bad about the mail so they're like doing push-ups? You could also do push-ups. <laughs> no. No need for that. I am naturally muscular. There's no naturally. such thing as naturally muscular. For real? Arm wrestle? The closest naturally muscular is a person who eats a ton no, of food but has a metabolism a and keeps them thin. If I win, you'll complain that I hurt your arm. And if I let you in, I'll be hearing about it for weeks. It's a trap. Akbar ding, gets ding, here. Ding. Win by default. See? Naturally muscular. Oh yeah, the whole uh, stat up thing. How does that? Oh wait, I, I, I right. think I know where. Give me those medical plants of yours. Time to fire up the synthesis. Uh, excuse me, the line was medicinal. Thing, we'll be right back on our feet. <laughs> Are you sure you know how? I have a synthesizer in my ship. Of course I know how these work. Uh, no, wait, that's not the way. 
I know what I'm doing. Oh no, he's back seat. Really? He's back seat. Because at this stage, you should. Ugh, look, I've always done it this way, and it's always worked out. See, guys, I've always done it this way. My own synthesis. She is me. <laughs> I've always done it this way, and it always works out. You guys can play it by how I play. Guys, I have always done it this way, and it always works out how I play games. So, much like you, please. <laughs> so, how are the repairs coming along? Uh, I what a bit of the thing, but I well, we ought to. <laughs> Relatable. Hashtag. Uh, well. Oh, wow. We were really bad off that time, though. <laughs> Alright, let's see. So, could this Where do anything for us? are we right now? Mm, there about. There about and here about. I can guess without Astrolock. Do you really think that reactivating it could be dangerous? Let's just say... I'd prefer not to risk it. They, wanna, they don't want to reactivate their navigation because it might ping their location to the... That makes sense, honestly. Don't you want us to cure a little bit first? Yes, yes. So I had the extra meal made, right? It's just in the fridge. I mean, just because it works out doesn't mean it can't be better. I'm not saying it's better. I, neither did you. You didn't say her method was better. Just that her method works. <laughs> Much like I say, my I don't say my method is better. I say my method works. <laughs> Take a shower. Sorry. I have this problem with Aragon sometimes. <laughs> that exact issue. I know that issue. In the future, we still have that issue, <laughs> I guess. All right, let's let's see about this though. Synthesize. Uh... Oh, that's interesting. What what does a bunch of peppers do? Pepper pills. A little bit of healing, I guess. Nice. I I'll make just one for now. So, there. What do you say about that? Spicy meds. All right. I don't know. I mean, spices can way. help you out, and? perk you up. Sorry, I doubted you. And yeah, sorry. Uh, I love you. Okay, that's not what I was <laughs> expecting, but see, this is how you guys apologize to me. So say you love me. <laughs> so don't doubt me, please. <laughs> Also, I can face into the table. That's really cool. What are, they, what are they doing over here? Oh, yeah, this machine, right. Oh, the antigrav, yeah. I am gonna kill them. The antigrav? I swear I am gonna kill them. Are you sure you don't want to take a break and get some fresh air? No. Okay. These bleeding antigrav chips aren't the boss of me. Wow, she really is me. Understand what the problem is. Gets intensely the into a project. Is, <laughs> there is such a thing as a standard. <laughs> And Thanks, the guys. Borons who designed this drone thought it might be fun to improve this standard. Except Borons? if you take a standard and improve upon it, you get stupid. Two standards sometimes, but you don't always get a better standard. Two standards? Zero standard. Exactly. <sighs> and so now it looks like I have to machine these boron chips. Just so they can fit in these bluting boots. Uh Anything I can do to help? No. Shush. Okay. Go away. I'm done. <laughs> what? But that was super quick. Well, yeah. When you have the right tools. I mean, since you were complaining, I was thinking that it would take a while. Oh, no, okay. It's I could complain about... Possible. Yeah, exactly. Let's go. We'll see if these work outside. It doesn't matter how hard it is. It's just fucking frustrating. I, I, I really am her. Holy fuck. <laughs> Ready to test these bad boys? I guess. What are we doing? See, I got forced outside, though. See, that's exactly what I'm talking about. this time, we should be able to make it till the end. See, this is exactly what I'm talking about. Like, this is the stuff I, I freaked... Like, I wasn't done on the nest, but it took me outside. I don't like that. I, that really throws well, me off. it was a pleasure meeting you guys. How about I go back in? Good, okay. I really don't like it. It's like, hey... I much prefer if a game's like, Hey, why don't we go outside and test these? And then right. and I'm... You can open your eyes. Surprise anniversary! What? Huh? For doing what? <laughs> I meant to say surprise, and then I thought happy anniversary. I still. I, I mean, I appreciate I'm not locked Who out of the nest, but like. Anniversary is it? It's our anniversary. 
One month. What I'm saying is a better idea than forcing me outside of the nest all of a sudden is saying you should go outside the nest. And then letting me walk out on my own. I feel much better with the, hey, let me walk out on my own. Hey, let me go here on my own. Hey, don't just force me there. Unless it's really helpful, like, I'm at the end of a dungeon and it takes me to the beginning, so I have to walk all the way back. That That's understandable, but, like, you know what I mean. Though, granted, I have played games where I got to the end of a dungeon, advanced the cutscene, and the cutscene dumped me at the beginning of the dungeon, and then I was like, but I didn't open the treasure chest at the end! And then I had to walk all the way back through. <laughs> So I'm just saying, like, let me know if you're teleporting me and give me that choice. A lot of games don't do that. <laughs> love, love, Only a love. What? Oh. Are you saying I'm boring uh, company? Excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> silly. It's just that, that was a robot voice. So distant. We've done so many things. Learned so much. I feel like I've lived more. It, it's it's a voice. Here. That's a voice I effect. That was not the echo. That was a robot angry. voice. Different. Oh yeah. I feel the same. So, are you gonna open your present? Well, our present. Sure. Sure. Oh, okay, Zachary. Thank you. Um. Uh-huh. What is it? Fermented apple dews. Oh. I stuck them in the soaker tub to accelerate the process. I'm calling it apple brew. Hmm. That could work. Do you think that it's any good? Well, worst case scenario, we just wasted some apple dews. No big deal. Should we open it now? We can open it whenever you want. We've already eaten too much. No, you haven't. I can never eat too much. Precisely. Okay. I've already eaten too much. <laughs> Wait. We've already eaten too much. Is there another line there? To us. Oh, okay. Wait, what? Did I just like brute force eat? <laughs> hey, that's really good, actually. <laughs> that really strong too. Do you remember the first time you talked about leaving the apiary? <laughs> of course. I'd had a shouting match with my mom. I was just angry. I clicked a different object. Yeah, that makes before sense. That, I didn't even see the object. Before? We had landed the nest on a hilltop. We were stargazing. And you said, come on, let's go. Hmm? I haven't stopped thinking about it since that day. I think that's what pushed me to dig into the Astro Company archives, which led me to find the coordinates of Source. I wanted to be ready for the day. It was supposed to be the characters. Fair. Wait, when was that? I don't remember. Right at the beginning, you and your mom got in a fight. You hopped into the nest at night, and you picked me up at my house. Was that when we went to the uplands? Yes, the uplands. That's it. Oh, <laughs> Flute, I remember. It was in Frosember. It was super Fro cold. Frosember? <laughs> I was freezing. I just wanted to get back into the nest. That's why I said, let's go. <laughs> and since you didn't respond, I thought you wanted to stay outside, so I didn't push it. I actually caught a beast of a cold that night. Wait, so that means if I hadn't misunderstood that night... It wouldn't have changed a thing. Well, still, that means we would have never known about Source. We would have never come all the way here. Mm, I'm not buying your story. Huh? Why were we stargazing that night? You spent the entire night pointing out this and that constellation to me, wondering if there might be other inhabitable planets frozen, outside frozen, of the yeah. <laughs> other forms of life. You were completely obsessed with the sky. I was even trying to open up about my issues, but you barely listened. And off you went again, chattering about the comets, the microorganisms, or whatever. So. Keeping in mind that you had access to this data about Source, and the fact that you are K, do you really think you would have never stumbled upon this planet anyway? You might be right. Was I really that annoying? <laughs> yes. I came to see you that night because I needed someone. I had nowhere else to go. But at the time, I regretted it. I was actually thinking it would be the last time we saw one another, but you insisted. And the following week, you came to see me in the evening with your little homemade cookies. We chatted all night, and I do believe that is when I fell in love. The cookies? <laughs> really? The cookies? 
that's what made you fall in love? Sound, sounds appropriate. In my defense, they were some excellent cookies. She really is me. <laughs> no, idiot. It wasn't the cookies. It was the thoughtfulness. But yeah. I was sick. My nose was all swollen. Croaking voice. I was a mess. Food's the bonus, and not the re showed up uh, not the focus. Surprisingly, though, for even for me. I've only known you for barely three weeks. You took care of me. <coughs> you baked me some cookies. The thought. You stayed and chatted all night, even though it was pretty clear nothing would happen. And you kept on making me laugh, even though it hurt every time I laughed. I hated you. What was it? Spirit did human? Yeah, I guess so. Or did you hate me? A well, animals, humans expensive. are animals, but. Kind of like salty sweet. Here. Give me a taste. <laughs> New gliding tricks. 360 grabs and backflips. Sweet. But with the power of love, we've become a better pro skater uh, or something. Max health up. <laughs> nice. Oh, what? That's an odd pose to find. Cool. So that's how you level up. You. I'm not actually sure what I did to level up, I'll be honest. Plus, I want to see something. I want to see something with this eat line, though. I never eat too much. Okay. I've already eaten too much. <laughs> she should have responded with that line I was thinking earlier. She should have responded with when she said when he says, "Okay, I've already eaten too much." That's fine. I'll eat your portion then. She should have said. <laughs> That's what I would have said. What exactly? <laughs> But, uh, I think I'll call it here, guys. This has been really... Does it save automatically? I assume it does. This actually has been really nice. Um, like I said, there's some nitpicks. I always have nitpicks with almost any game, but... Uh, the problems we addressed, they're one-time problems. I don't have them now. They were problems, but now they're not. So, you know. Issue ends. Not such a big deal. But, yeah, I, I think this game was pretty nice. Definitely has a laser focus on what it wants to be. It's, you know, it's kind of, it's a bit small scale. It's not like we're exploring a, well, we are exploring. We're, ex I wonder if there's different biomes and stuff for this, for these islands, or if we'll just go through. I wonder if it's always just grassy islands. That's okay if it is, but it, it might get a little bit samey after a while. But I do wonder what the story, how the story might progress and stuff. This definitely has a, a very good hook of the story. And, uh, yeah, I like this a lot, actually. Um, planet's bigger than you think. Fair enough, fair enough. It's hard to tell about. It's hard to tell right now what the scale of the game is, but uh, if it is indeed bigger, rare or but stark changes. Fair enough. Fair enough. But um, but yeah, that was Haven, and uh, it's a little bit different than your typical game. Honestly, it's the narrative focus is is not unusual for video games. There's many many, many other games that have narrative focuses too, but I do like the way it's presented in this game. It's it's done very naturally, which. Definitely helps you get invested. But, uh, yeah, that was Haven. <laughs>